Hey, this is Seth Juarez from Dev Express here with Sebastian. Now, how do you say your last name? Eberhard? Eberhard, right. Fantastic. They're all the way from Germany. We're at TechEd 2014. I don't know if I said that. And I happened by, they came by and told us a little bit about their product, and I wanted to, for you to talk about it. What do you guys do? Um, we actually have an application that synchronizes corporate address books mm -hmm. to mobile devices. And uh, we basically have different data sources like Active Directory or SharePoint lists to fill in the blanks. That's fantastic. That seems like a very important thing. So you have a list of contacts from a number of places and you're pretty much syncing them. Yes, right. So the reason why I wanted to talk to these guys is because it turns out that you're using one of our products. Which product are you using? Uh, we're using uh, DevExpress, Express App Framework. Mm -hmm. Um, with the workflow components and uh, XPO as the data layer, basically. That's fantastic. And so from the data layer using XPO and using XAF as the application framework to build right. your stuff, can you show us a little bit what you got? Yeah, that's um, the main screen of the application mm -hmm. where we basically start out with a dashboard that uh, contains the statistics of the agents that import the data to our uh, address books and um, basically it shows licensing and um, we have different uh, menus to, to configure address books to uh, to give permission to certain groups of employees mm -hmm. to uh, to connect to the address books from their mobile devices, I basically. See. So, what kind of what kind of providers can you connect to? Uh, in terms of uh, data sources, that's right. Um, we have different modules, basically. We can connect to Active Directory or okay. generic LDAP directories. Um, we connect to Exchange Global Address Lists or exchange folders, be they public or in a mailbox. That's fantastic. Um, and this is all XAF. Yeah, right. So what do you think about the experience with XAF? Why did you choose it and what has it done for you? Uh, we basically chose XPF, XAF because um, we wanted to have um, a GUI for our application that is actually nice to use and uses standardized controls uh -huh. um, and basically not not bother with uh, GUI design to be frank Correct. too much. So. so how easy was it to use? Was there What was the learning curve like? Was it hard at first and then it got easier? Or what was it like? Yeah, it was a bit hard at first, but uh, we got started out fairly well uh -huh. because we uh, uh, generated the data model from an existing MySQL database. Fantastic. And uh, later on we ported to Microsoft SQL Server and uh, we added our own classes uh, to the data model to provide for agents and, and stuff. So let me ask you about this. Tell me about speed. Is it pretty fast? Yeah, I would say so, yeah. Fantastic. Well, let's see. Let's see how fast it is. Let's click around and let's look at some stuff here. So, sure. I mean, it's, it's pretty responsive, I would say, if you open up a uh, screen, a switch. Right. Um, it's pretty good, I would say, and this is still our demo environment, so it's limited in time in of terms course, of resources. Of course. So, and we have a uh, nice. Uh, we have been able to build in validation. So, oh, fantastic! Um, for example, we have uh, we have to schedule our agents, the the loading of the data. So, we use uh, cron. Okay. as a scheduler basically fantastic. so there are certain expressions that are allowed and certain that aren't that's, so that's fantastic so you're um, using the validation module and you said you were using the workflow module is that correct yes that is correct so we use the workflows um, to control the workflow how okay. the data is loaded okay. basically we have different steps we have to once get the data out of the, the source system, uh -huh. like Active Directory, uh -huh. save that as CardDAV, and then we have to load it into the CardDAV server. That's fantastic. And so you're using workflow to manage each of those steps inside of XAF. Right. And we have a, a service, the, the workflow service service actually, that uh, does the processing, uh -huh. and the workflow server service also schedules the execution. So the service is actually fairly generic, so we can extend the uh, application with a new type of agent without actually having to reconfigure 
the service itself. That's fantastic. And all in XAF. So overall, are you happy with what you've done at XAF? Yeah, sure. Fantastic. Well, I don't know what else to say. If you're thinking about building an application, you could follow uh, Sebastian's advice, use XAF. And we're happy that you're a customer, and we'd love to showcase some of your products. We'll probably put a page up with some of the stuff that they're building. Thanks for watching, and thank you for choosing DevExpress. Thank you very much.